As you get older, you realize what matters and what doesn't. You kind of decide what is going to bother you and what is something you're going to care about. My name is Clay Conger, and I was born on January 22nd, 1988. I love to write. I've been doing it ever since I was eight years old. I just saw a kid writing in a journal, and I thought, Wow, instead of reading a novel, he's kind of writing one, and it just took off from there. I can't really say where it came from, I just know that once I kind of caught that bug, so to speak, I couldn't get rid of it. Every day, there's at least one point where I'm thinking of a short story I want to write, or a type of song I want to compose, or a movie I want to not only watch, but also analyze. So there's never a point where I'm just content with just thinking nothing and not creating anything. Not to criticize people who aren't creative types, but I can't live without trying to make something like that. I don't honestly think any number of bad teachers or bad influences could make me stop. I've had people read my stuff and tell me it's total crap. I've had people tell me that there's no point to try to become a published author because there's too many out there and there's no money in it. But I always just moved past it. I take feedback, but nothing could make me stop. No amount of negativity could. If it's something you actually love to do, you're actually passionate about, don't stop. If it's something you just think is interesting, then you know, maybe you want to pursue other fields. But if it's something that's really deep in your heart, you can't sleep at night without writing that new idea on a napkin nearby, then you, you can't stop. You can't do that to yourself. You, don't, you stop caring about what people think of you as much. You stop caring about the little insignificant things. You stop caring about whether you committed some faux pas at a party. You, you just don't care because that stuff takes about too much of your time. And as you start running out of time, you start to cherish it more. I think writing is what I'm most proud of. It's also the hardest one for me because it's just, I don't think a lot of people understand just how difficult it is to write and write well. But it's the thing I've been doing ever since I could remember. That's how I'd like to end my life, knowing that I did something real and meaningful with that kind of gift. Happy birthday to everyone born January 22nd. Thank you for watching. We're uploading an episode every single day featuring a different person. Please like, share, and subscribe. We really appreciate your support.